Auntie Laura's having fun. She slightly overstretched herself this week with three larger dogs than normal, which when you have them on their own, you think no problem at all. But three of them um, is, is quite a worry, but at least I've got a garden, as you can see, that they're going to play in, which is great. If they can do this, that's marvellous. I've um, got two little ones coming still. Evie the Laza and Mickey the Cavalier and this little black Cavapoo Molly is going home this evening so it'll be Barley in the foreground the Tibetan here all week yes Barley Butchie who's growing by the minute but I love him he's a gentle giant Cockapoo and a little smaller Cockapoo called Tilly I don't feel so bad that I can't walk them so many if they play in my garden and run off some of their exercise, their um, their liveliness rather. So this is going to be a rather busy week, but I've lined up a neighbour who owns Teddy. The uh, I've gone blank. The Poochon uh, to help me with walking on Tuesday. I can't do it tomorrow because I have Chester the Bichon also coming for doggy daycare. So in my little house it's very crammed. But they're happy and to me that is the most important thing. And I'm sure you all agree that they're eating and they're happy and they're being spoilt by Auntie Laura. What do you think, Butchie? Butchie! Hello, darling! Who has <coughs> grass seed all over them? And barley pops. And Tilly and Molly. <coughs> no barking. No barking, Barley. So there's Laura's little lodgers. Not quite so little. Laura's... Larger little lodges. <laughs>